Well, a state representative who used social media to warn people to be wary of Muslim Americans isn't sorry he said it. And now a religious scholar at OU is challenging the lawmaker's knowledge of Islam. News 9's Steve Shaw is live in the newsroom with this new at 10. Steve? Kelly, Representative John Bennett tonight did not back off what he wrote on Facebook earlier this month. In fact, he says people need to get educated on Islam. So many people say, well, you're a hate monger and this and that. But, but the, the fact of the matter is I'm trying to uh, educate people on Islam. And if they're Muslim Americans um, and they subscribe to Islam, then they're just as bad as ISIS that's overseas doing what they're doing under the flag of Islam. John Bennett is resolute in what he says and believes. God bless the great state of Oklahoma. There's a dominant ideological trend in the Islamic society is, just, is hate filled. But Dr. Charles Kimball says Bennett is wrong. Should we be wary of Muslim Americans? Well, not generically. I think that that kind of monolithic uh, painting everybody with the same brush. Uh, is a very, very unfortunate, I think a very dangerous kind of stereotype. Dr. Kimball is one of only eight Americans who met with Iran's Ayatollah Khomeini during the hostage crisis three and a half decades ago. He's written five books on Islam, including this one titled, When Religion Becomes Lethal. Kimball says the Islamic Bible, known as the Koran, does not spew the hate for other religions, as Bennett claims. I'd be delighted to have a public conversation with him. Uh, he quotes the Quran and he says he has studied all this and he knows the history of Islam uh, as somebody, and I'm an ordained Baptist minister. I'm, I'm very actively involved and engaged as a person of faith within the Christian tradition. I would be delighted to have a public conversation with him. Representative Bennett tonight told me he would welcome such a debate. Steve Shaw, News 9.